All right, so to begin with, be before we actually build our own restaurant, like I said, we, we need to come up with uh, the idea of what restaurant style we want to build, right? All right, so how we will be able to get the restaurant type that we actually want to build and where can we like get some ideas out of the style we want so technically there is a lot of way you can get ideas to build a restaurant because maybe some of you have played some restaurant tycoon restaurant simulator game before and you you pretty much know what to do but if you haven't played any restaurant game before like I do I haven't played any restaurant simulation ever to be honest so what I did is um, let me just show you so what I did was I um, I go to uh, <laughs> of course I go to Google Sama and we can actually start building things let me just uh, quickly open up the uh, chat box all right um, let's just uh, quickly go into the rest of the map that I built yesterday just to quickly show you guys again what I did so <clears throat> what I did was I used this uh, this brown wooden blocks for the floor I used the um, white blocks for the ceiling the, the roof the one I used some um, some bricks and some white wooden blocks as well for the window I use the um, very simple brown and glasses uh, table chair and for kitchen I use something else for the kitchen I use a different type of uh, floor I use a different type of uh, what else did I use oh the, the one I mean I did something different oh wait why is this like here hold on it shouldn't be here hold on it should be like this oh, okay there we go alright so that basically how you build a restaurant you can be um, like even more like invested in your restaurant by having like second floor like the um, Chinese lecture maps yesterday you can have multiple floor if you feel like uh, one floor is not enough you can always do that okay what is going on and so we will upload the maps again okay so so if you ever ran into this issue when you cannot uh, upload your maps you just cancel it just cancel the upload and then re-upload the maps okay that is the, the the most common way that I do all right so now let let's just start a new space so we can build things right now let's go creation dev mode we will go to um, we go to flat crash land turn off monster and animal and let's start uh, first of all I always do this I always lock my time and turn the weather to sunny so uh, that won't disturb me when I'm, I'm building <laughs> you, you guys should also do that just make it a habit and you will not be disturbed while building because when the sky turns dark you will not see a thing and you cannot build a thing so okay so let's just put away all of these and keep these two. These two are the most like essential tools to build anything. Uh, all right. So, uh, like I said, if you have already designed, if you have already designed a style of restaurant you want to build, then you can just join in and just build up your 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 restaurant model. Um, I will just create a space for each of you. So hold on. Can I turn on my mic? Wait, hold on. Okay, I I can. Alright, so uh, maybe um, just choose a space you want to build and then you, you, you can follow what I do but you can decide what you want to build like you can choose the type of blocks you want to build anything you like okay so first we will start with the floor okay the, the floor of your restaurant so uh, you just um, can use this um, tools you can choose the type of blocks you want for the floor uh, personally I think I want to use the wooden one but for restaurant you can use anything you want to there's some very like creative one down here like this one this one and this one you can use all of this um, 
I'm not sure which one I want to use for the tutorial though. I still feel like the the wood one is the best one to use for the floor of a restaurant. Uh, but there's also many type of wood. So let's say I want to use this one for the floor. Okay, so uh, yeah, so oh, so so you just build. A, uh, I think this is this is the kitchen, right? Well, yeah. I mean. We should start with the kitchen, right? I mean, we have a living room and a kitchen, so uh, yeah, just just lo do the kitchen first. So maybe we choose uh, uh, the kitchen should be at least twenty times twenty. Uh, in my opinion, the the kitchen should be at least like this big. Well, definitely need to be bigger, but for um, a small map. 20 times 20 is uh, quite enough. You can put like furnitures around it. Now this person is designing his own restaurant door. Like, oh, we we do need like a, a restaurant gate right now. We, we haven't got that, so uh, maybe just uh, create a, a restaurant door somewhere here. So like this, let's make it a big door because uh, it is the, the main entrance. So like this will be the main entrance of our restaurant. This is the living room area. This is the, the kitchen way. Uh, you can also add like uh, extra things like a, a parking lot or a restroom. You can do all of that uh, around your main restaurant. So you also use this too to create different space. So like let's say if you want to create a parking lot, you just need to um, use this too. Um, let's say the parking lot is all the way out here and just use uh, the time block for the parking lot. So let's say the parking lot is this block. So there we go. So this, this way will be the parking lot. If you want to do it, like you can add in anything you want to your restaurant. Like for a Pokemon restaurant, you can add, even add in like a, a Pokemon like stadium or whatever you want. As long as you still go with the restaurant theme, you can be creative with your restaurant, okay? Uh, for this, um, this door, usually what I do with the, the main door, I place glass to it. Because glass looks nice. Uh, I will show you how you can make a glass door really nice. So you just use glass like this. Just uh, place everything in this type of glass because no, this one because you want to uh, be able to uh, place the, the door handle like this. So if you place um, the block, it will be like too thick. So basically, I usually do the door like this, and if it's closed right now, if it's an open door like uh, this, then you can also place the handle in between like this. Okay, so hold on. Actually, let's let's do that. So let's just place the handle in between like this. Alright, so that is how uh, you make a glass door. Okay, wait, what? Wait, there it is. Okay. okay. So this is the glass door, pretty much. Nice. It's glass and just have a, it's, it's glass and just have a, a what? A wooden handle to it. Alright, so now we can add anything we want in our restaurant, like table, chairs, uh, even some fish tank and stuff. Alright, so just quickly, I will show you guys how to um get the things you can use in your restaurant maps. Okay, so I will show you how to get. Oh, nice, nice, nice. I mean, you guys already are doing a very well job without like any custom model right now. This looks very nice. The the tree, the sakura trees right here looks very nice. 
but basically this is how wrestling works. So you can raise the death and chair in any way you want. You can have them in one row, you can have like each of them like this, any way you want. Or you can even make like a maze of tables. My bamboo wrestling? Where's the bamboo wrestling? What? Oh, we have another wrestling. Oh. Oh. This one is also nice. I mean, they use like a purple glass. Looks kind of like a, a night um, toughest. Like soft right on. I mean, it's nice. And this guy's still designing his own. I think this one is like a palace time wrestling, which is very unique. I have never seen like a, like this kind of wrestling. I'm not sure what he's planning to do, but it does look very unique. Alright. Wait, what? Oh, there's another wrestling over here. I see, I see. Is, is Carrots over here? Oh, I see. So this is a bamboo wrestling. Oh, actually it's nice. I mean, the bamboo does make a very major look to the restaurant living room. Like, it's, it's nature friendly and it's unique. I like it. So, this, this, this player is dressed up as a panda <laughs> and she has a bamboo restaurant, which is nice. You can use this idea for the upcoming event. The mini game come to event, which is being your own restaurant. Okay? This is nice. Uh, and we also have this not on the ground restaurant or just someone who built <laughs> random things on the sky. I don't know what this is. Alright. So, um, meanwhile, I will show you guys how to actually get furniture for your restaurant. Uh, yes, you can build your own furniture. You can use the things available in the games like uh, these. Some of these. Yeah, these are bed, these are table, chair, which are unlockable by mini beams in the game. Uh, if you don't like these designs, you can always go to. You can always go to. Where is it? Where is the this yeah you go to the the house icon you go to gallery you can always do this and actually actually just for okirito oh very nice <laughs> i always got distracted by the uh anime term things a chopper very nice very nice very nice anyway so actually for this tutorial mini captain actually make a separate category of uh, miniature for you guys where is it okay so this is the new one that mini captain just add in just for uh, this tutorial and for you guys to build your own restaurant for the upcoming event so this is the kitchen and dining topics so as soon as you click on it you have every models for your kitchen i mean out there there if, if you go to category and you go to filter, you go to furniture, you could confirm maybe you will find some that is not in the topic. But if you want to be uh, very fast and efficient, you can always go to topic. Mini Captain has already prepared this topic for you to build your own restaurant. And so far, it has a lot of like on topic models in here. You have chair you have table very elegant chair uh, you have uh, some cake we have some self even a dress can uh, we have some vending machine coca-cola we have some cooking tools right here uh, we have uh, our cooker and a lot of stuff a lot of stuff that I don't even use in my map yet. Very nice. So if, if you want to look for these, you just go to the topic area. You you will see the kitchen and dining room, dining room. Okay.
Wait, what? <laughs> what are you trying to do? <laughs> you should play some like bars like window just like in the prison, I guess. And now it's on fire. I mean, no, that's not a good idea placing your window on fire. You can use like um, normal windows like this, or you can use glass. Call it glass, anything you want. So if you want windows like this, you can. If you want glass, you just play glass in like this. So uh, these are just the, the type of windows you can make. Uh, yes, you can, also, you can also use like these. If you are creative enough to um, apply some of these blocks, you can even make a window like this. Something like this. Yeah, maybe. Like you just uh, it like that. They also a very nice design if you think about it. Like all of these blocks right here, you can use it in a way that can make windows, doors, and stuff. Uh, is there any other types of windows that we can make with blocks? I think there are, but it, it, it all depends on you. If you are creative enough, you can do anything. Okay, so this is like a color window. Very nice, very nice. The yeah, orange, green. Oh, I'm in prison. <laughs> yes, you are in prison. You're in my prison now. <laughs> uh, we have, oh, we have more of this. Okay, so this is definitely, uh, is this, uh, what is this? Is this some type of mochi? Or is it, I don't know what this is. <laughs> can anyone tell me what this is? It looks familiar. I just don't know the, the word to call it. That, that's the thing. It's manto. What is manto? I don't think I have, I, I have ate this, this yet. I'm not sure. It does look familiar. Like the, the way you build it, I kind of recognize it. I just don't know the word for it. Oh, bam, bam. Oh, okay, it, it makes sense now. Is there an English name for that? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if there's an English word for bam, bam. When you are in single player mode, uh, as you can see, we have this tool right here that I talked about. The handle editor, you just use this, you click on the blocks, and you look at tribal setting, and you can adjust the light intensity of the blocks. So the more you raise it, the brighter the blocks will be. And you just save it, you enter your game, and then your restaurant will be as bright as daytime. If you don't do that, it, it, it might be a little bit like dark on the ceiling. Uh, it still be bright in the window because they're light from outside. All right. So now how do you place your decoration? Uh, so after you download something, you just go to uh, the main library, you go to the default folder, you will scroll down and you will see the download models. Uh, you just take them, you put it on your uh, inventory bar and then you just play it in your, in your restaurant. If you want to adjust the attribute of this block, you have to create a plugin version of it. If you don't want to adjust anything and just for decoration, you can just play it, place it down like this. So let's say this this block is a decoration, so I didn't create a plugin version, but uh, like for example, some dead of the desk, I did make a plugin version of them. Um, let's just quickly show you guys what I meant. So click on this, click on plugin. You will see I have tons of blocks, which are the ingredients and the recipes of the food in the maps. So these are actually make the blocks for it. Uh, this one is for uh, the the pictures, <laughs> the habitat, the the pictures of the the path. So yeah, this one, right? So yeah. So now we can um, try and build um, try and build our try and build our own um, dish now. Let me show you how to build a dish recipes in our map. So uh, let's just go to the building area in this map. It should be on the back. Okay, here here is the building area, uh, which I build some food and ingredient in this map. All right, so uh, let me just take out the tools we need before we start building. We have this number three, this number five. We have a uh, the color tools here and our blocks on the very first and this one on the second okay so this is my tool set you should have one in order to build things more efficiently right so uh, let's just first try it and think of what we should build